came back for more. Um, Majora's Mask. So, um, I got the <laughs> big spawn bag. And this episode, we're going to get a mask. And... Do some stuff in, um... After we get the mask, the next transformation mask, we're gonna do some stuff in the storyline. Then, well, if we don't do that in time... <laughs> hey, that rhymes. Um, then we'll go over to the milk thing. The milk thing. A little scripted, dude. <laughs> um, I mean the... Sun mask makes it that you can't be seen, but... Um, if it takes you long on that, which I doubt it, um... Now I'll go ahead and, um... Get... Get the bottle from Long Long Ranch. You know, the operation about the aliens and stuff. <laughs> I'll do that if I take too long. Right now I'm gonna buy some bombs. Cause there's a hover we can do that saves quite a bit of time and I do not feel like trekking through this whole annoying thing. That's why I'm getting this. Just so you know. <laughs> okay. Also, the only time I use C stick besides the um, when I the only time I use C stick is when I'm playing my author, you know. <laughs> Cause I am not that used to it. Sure, I'm used to it when I can see the buttons on the screen and stuff, but I'm not used to it <laughs> enough. So I still use C-Stick when I play the Ocarina. Which I'll probably do for my entire life. I love the bunny hood, it's awesome. But I don't kind of, I really don't need it right now. <laughs> anyway, here is this dude. Says hold him to shore. Well, let's push him. <laughs> Link, that looks weird. By weird, I mean wrong. <laughs> um. Well, I guess he's kind of dead, and he wants us. Well, not really dead, but you know, weak. So he wants us to push him to shore. That's actually really good. I've never gotten that far before. <laughs> um. After just talking to him, well, pushing him on shore. I think I can just immediately pull out my ocarina and start playing the song feeling, so we can get the next mask. Um, this is a pretty tragic mask, I guess, to get. I love how Macau just like walks straight through us. It's, that's great. <laughs> Honestly. Just like, uh, what's up? Uh, I'm gonna walk through you. <laughs> what the heck, Macau? Don't disrespect. Anyway, play song feeling. Left, right, down. You put a song backwards. If you don't believe me, just look at it. In real, in your, you don't realize. Anyway, here's this little emotional cutscene. If you're like that, but I'm, <laughs> I'm really not. I don't fall to emotional things like this. right now. <laughs> Ridiculous dude. A little earlier, I'm ashamed to say, <laughs> but I was watching a freaking um, Pokemon Blue speedrun because I was bored. <laughs> to be completely honest, I was bored. <laughs> I'm watching on um, whatever dude, but well, just talking about the cutscene. Here we are, this is the band from Zora Hall. If we ever go there, I kind of doubt it, but... <laughs> This is the band. Oh, we're in, um, on Wednesday in one of our classes, our first class, um, we were talking about Soda Band from New York. And, um, how, like, fun Soda was banned and stuff. Me and my friend made up a Soda Band. Like, not so the Soda was banned, but a literal Soda Band. Yeah, exactly. Call City if you want. It's one. We got the Mora mask. Or the Mora mask. <laughs> Laura mask. Mora mask. Eora mask. Zora mask. Oh, well, it is Zora mask. Cool. But anyway, we've got a mask. That's the point. 
I'm just like, I salute you. Whatevs. Anyways, now we're gonna start up. Um, and we've got that done, we're gonna start up on Kyrx Fortress. But first of all, we need some bombs. We need more money for that. And, well, here's the <coughs> Confirmation Resort link. Doesn't look like Macau. It's, well, he looks like Macau, except he doesn't have the tattoos. There's also a bottle we can get right now, so I'll get it after Pirate's Fortress. After I go to the Pirate's Fortress. Because there's another place we actually have to do some stuff with bottles. So I'll get that after Pirate's Fortress. Because there's Pirate's Fortress, and there's another place we have to collect some stuff, if you know what I mean. So, yeah. One, two, three, four. Basically, that's the setup for this. Sometimes you still fail, sadly. But that's the <laughs> best setup. Though I wasn't perfectly straight there, so that's why it didn't work. One, two, three, four. When you're straight, it works, but if you're like slightly off or something, it is getting annoying. I'm gonna try one more time. Like, seriously, that's the setup, but I'm not being straight. One, two, three, four. Throw the orb boomerang. What the heck? I'll try one more time out here. What if I try to set it? That's human link. One, two, three, four. Throw the Finally! There we go. That was a little bit more money. Enough to fill my needs. Well, I still don't have a bomb. So I'm gonna go get some bombs from over here. Then I'm gonna go clock down. Then I'm gonna sort back. Then we'll get started with the, well, I guess I could say actual video. Because <laughs> seven minutes of bullcrap. Well, eight, technically. Almost. Eight minutes of bullcrap, basically. Well, actually, not totally. More like, they're like four. Because then the cow cuts in. Because he's my cow, yo. Oh my god, dude. I really need to stop making bad jokes. You guys agree? Oh yeah! I've had Link just like rocket rockets into the sea. Wait, no, I have to soar. Well, we have to play a song here, because this is a song we play the song so we can get into the... So this place where you play the song so we can get into the, uh, uh, temple. Which is by far the most annoying temple. <laughs> I mem I haven't memorized stray fairy locations of it, and that's what makes it annoying when I write very 100% it. And I get lost very easily. <laughs> so, overall, it's my worst temple. In Ocarina of Time, my worst temple is Shadow. By far, just by far, Shadow. I'd say Twilight Princess would be Snow Peak. <laughs> yeah, my worst temple is Snow Peak in Twilight Princess. I love how Zorlax just like clipped in there. Like, okay, dude, stop. Perfecto. But now I'm just gonna get some bombs and some chews so we can do some hovers. Bomb. Chew. Chew. Um, I'll get you. The reason I got, uh, three chews instead of <laughs> two bombs to chews. Because I already got some bombs, first of all. Second of all, I can get some more bombs. <laughs> Basically, this, uh, this shop's the only convenient place to get bomb chews. In the entire game. There's, like, one or two chests with, like, <laughs> Um, yeah, there's like one or two chests in the game with like um, one bomb chew in them. One's over here in Great Bay and one's in um, near Ikana entrance. Cause Ikana, not believe it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do I keep making bad jokes? Um, yeah, exactly. 
because I, even if I got the third bottle, I'd have to make two trips to, um, Patch Fortress anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Now we're going head over to Patch Fortress. We don't really need the map and stuff, but it helps. It definitely helps. Rolling rocks. <laughs> oh my god, um, when I was recording Ocarina of Time, like, um, I'd say, like, three, four, five hours ago, like, the finale, I almost got killed by Ganon so many times, but I did a backflip once, saved me. Shield, saved me. I would have died. It was quick reflexes. Um, also, another time, I rolled, and since, and I have four hearts, and Ganon before killed me, but you know that since the end of your roll year, since, um, like, like, I'd say, like, right here, I'm invincible, because it's the, near the end of my roll. Um, that's where I was in my roll, and I got hit by Gandorf, but I didn't die. I was so close so many times. That was so ridiculous. There's also a new strat for the- oh, they probably not new, but there's a strat for the jumping game over there that you can get a piece of crap from. Play it after creating this area, which I'll show, but I'm not going to win. Anyway, here we are. N L Pyretro Forsetto. I don't know how to say it in Spanish. I'm just gonna say it like that. Uh, anyway, so if you're redstone mask here at almost all times, yep. Basically, just want to hop on a boat of the pirates and um, uh, get on get on them if you're if you have a stone mask. But in other cases, you just want to get around here on the Zora when you know, there's when the pirate isn't in here. Then deep, dive dive under the water and get over there, which we're sailing on the pirate ship as a rather than hover over there. If you're doing speed run, which will I'm gonna use stone mask strap. That's that up again. No, but speed speedrun strap. Well probably for one hundred percent, but this isn't one hundred percent. It's one hundred merfence. Cause that makes so much sense. Um I'm gonna need stone mask. But yeah, also if you're doing one hundred percent Make sure you take a picture with your picture draft box of one of the Drill Pirates after you knock them out with your bow or your sword. Because you can get a piece of heart after doing something with it. But I'm not going to since, well, this is a, sadly, <laughs> poor heart run. I'm sad to admit. Mythly, we're supposed to get over there. I, you saw Link pull out a sword without swinging it, right? It was just like, whatever, dude. supposed to get over here like way later by doing, going through the sewer system and stuff. Oh wow, <laughs> stuck my landing. I'm trying to do a mega side hop. God dang it, I don't even know how to do these. Can I even do mega side hops when hovering? Stop wasting time, dude. Not even that important. I saw it done before, just don't know how to performance. Cause like, I'm not sure. I'll figure it out later. But what else? For now, here are the pirates. Yeah, exactly. That's why I say pirates. Don't judge me. No, God dang it. Stone mask. Stone mask. Elbow. I, I want to see this. I want to see if this is amusing. Wait, do I even? I need to have stone mask on for a second. Crack stab. Crack stab. Ah, murder stab. Murder stab. Basically, I can't see with the stone mask on, and that's why um, stone mask is good for here. Also, um, go through here with the stone mask on. And they can't see you. If you come here with, with that stomach on, they'll throw you out. <laughs> um, there's a little cutscene here. Oh. Oh. I didn't know you could do... I know they did that. Okay, then we do have to go through the cutscene then. Okay. That's nice to know. So don't go there unless you're completely ninja. Which I'm not, so... <laughs> not gonna go there. 